Having a death note may seem like a tempting opportunity for some, but it's important to remember that the consequences can be severe. In the popular Japanese manga and anime series Death Note, written by Tsugumi Oba and illustrated by Takeshi Obata, the protagonist, Light Yagami, comes into possession of a supernatural notebook called the Death Note. This mysterious notebook has the power to kill anyone whose name is written in it. At first glance, it might appear to be a tool that allows for revenge or justice against those who have committed crimes or caused harm. However, as the story unfolds, it becomes evident that the Death Note is a dangerous and corrupting force, leading to moral dilemmas and the erosion of Light's own humanity. The Death Note comes with a set of specific rules that govern its usage. For instance, in order to kill someone, the user must know their target's full name and have a clear mental image of their face. There are also limitations on the cause of death that can be specified, but within those boundaries, the manner of death can be quite flexible. But with great power comes great responsibility, and this is where the moral complexity arises. The question becomes, who should have the authority to decide who lives and who dies? Light chooses to take on the role of judge, jury and executioner, believing that he can use the death note to rid the world of criminals and create a utopia. However, this quickly escalates into a cat and mouse game with the brilliant detective known as L, who is determined to catch the killer. Throughout the series, Light's actions become increasingly ruthless and heinous. His desire for power and control corrupt his original intentions, and he finds himself crossing lines he never thought he would. The responsibility of wielding the death note takes a toll on his mental and emotional well-being. The consequences of his actions begin to unravel his life his relationships and his sense of self. The Death Note explores themes of justice, morality and the slippery slope of power. It challenges us to consider the nature of right and wrong and the limits of human judgment. The series raises important questions about the ethical implications of capital punishment and the dangers of playing God. It forces us to confront the darker aspects of our own nature, the potential for manipulation and the corrupting influence of absolute power. In the world of Death Note, having a Death Note may seem like an enticing prospect, offering the opportunity to rid the world of evil. However, the story serves as a cautionary tale, illustrating the dangers of taking justice into our own hands and the devastating consequences that can arise from playing with forces beyond our understanding. So, if one were to find themselves in possession of a Death Note, the best course of action would be to resist its allure and refrain from using it for personal gain or vengeance. Instead, it would be wise to consider the potential harm it can cause and seek alternative methods of addressing societal issues or personal grievances. After all, the true pursuit of justice lies in upholding the principles of fairness, compassion and due process, rather than resorting to vigilante measures.